In this video, I'd like to show you how to show the password of the Wi-Fi that you are currently connected to. And that can be really useful because a lot of times you just connected to a Wi-Fi a long time ago and you don't remember the password. And with this trick, you'll be able to do it. But again, the disclaimer before the video begins. This feature only works on iOS 16, which is currently the latest version of iOS. At this point of time, it is only in the, the beta stage, but it also depends on when you're watching this. If you're watching it past September 2022, then it's gonna be publicly available and there is nothing to worry about, only to update to that version. My device here is currently running the beta version of that, so in case you would like to get it right away, then you'll be you'll definitely need to download the, the beta profile as well. But anyways, let's get started. The way it works is very simple. At first, you need to be connected to the Wi-Fi already. That is kind of obvious, but this is just how it works. You cannot really guess the password of a nearby Wi-Fi or anything like that. It has to be a Wi-Fi that you're connected to. Okay, so you go to the settings and you go, of course, to the Wi-Fi section and there are going to be some networks which are available that you can connect to, but right at the top with the blue tick next to it is the one that you are actually connected to at the same time. So at the right of it, there is the I icon for more information. It's the blue one, so if you tap on it, you can see a couple of options. So the first one is to forget the network, auto join, but there is also a password. And don't get confused with the number of dots, they do not represent anything, so you can easily just click on it. And it will show you the password that is, uh, that is part of the Wi-Fi. But if you have a Touch ID, Face ID, or even a passcode enabled, this is the first thing that you'll need to type in. It just has to make sure that you are the person, the user, the owner of the iPhone. So just type the passcode in or use uh, the Face ID and you can see uh, that password right away. It also gives you the option to click and copy it, to paste it somewhere else, perhaps to share it over the internet or to put it in your notes. So you don't have to manually type it one by one. You can just copy it very quickly. You can also take a screenshot of this, so you can save it in the photos gallery as well. And the good thing is that it's not gonna blur the password in a screenshot, because sometimes it can happen. Like, I would imagine that the same principle would be going on here. Like, if you'd like to record a screen record, some Netflix show or something, then it's just not gonna work. I would expect that the password is also gonna be blurred or something, but it doesn't, so yeah, you can easily just screenshot the screen and save it in the photos. So this is how it works. This is a very quick tutorial. I don't think that there is anything else what I should be talking about really, because I kind of mentioned all of the stuff. So if you enjoyed it, if you found it helpful, you can leave a comment saying pretty much whatever you want. I will most likely reply to your comment. And you can also subscribe so you don't miss future uploads and tips like these. You can leave a thumbs up as well, and we can see each other in the future. Have a great rest of the day.